FET202 computer system. So in this video we're going to be looking at the USB. So which of the following is an explanation of USB? Is it A? It is a serial interface that enables devices to be connected in a tree topology via a hub. Or is it B? It is a parallel interface used for connection of a hard disk or a pin printer in a daisy chain. Is it C? It is a parallel interface that is used for connection of a CD-ROM drive or a DVD drive installed in a PC. Or D, it is a serial interface that transfers data to a printer by using infrared rays. So USB is a serial interface that enables the PC and all peripheral devices to be connected via the same connector. By using USB, a maximum of 127 devices can be connected in a tree topology via a hub. This is called the cascade connection. Three types of transfer speed, namely the low speed, the full speed, and the high speed are given as below. Low speed is 1.5 megabits per second, full speed is 12 megabits per second, and high speed is 480 megabits per second. So here is a diagram of how the USB would look like. The hot plug is supported which enables removal and insertion of the connector while power is being supplied to the computer. The super speed mode 5 gigabits per second has been added to USB 3.0 with a power supply increase from 500 milliamps to 900 milliamps. Therefore A is the correct answer from our question. So let's look at what the other answers were describing. So the parallel interface used for connecting a hard disk or printer through a daisy chain is SCISI, or SCSI, Small Computer System Interface, defined by ANSI, the American National Standards Institute. In C, the parallel interface used for connecting the PC or CD-ROM drive provided in the PC is the ATA slash ATA PI cable, this or interface. AT attachment or AT attachment packet interface is what this stands for. Finally, in D, the serial interface that transfers data to a printer via infrared is called IRDA or infrared data association. So here we have found our correct answer to be A. So we've found a description of USB but also looked at some of the other communication types used within computer architecture.